Dan, thank you. NIPSCO officials say a mechanical failure with a floodgate is what caused water levels on Lake Schaefer to drop so low last week. Now crews are working to repair the gate. News 18's Elizabeth Rentschler has more on how long those repairs might take. Water levels on Lake Schaefer were back to normal Tuesday after dropping more than two feet late last week. Both flows are about 2,2500 2, cubic feet a second. Uh, when we were into the, the lake level problems, we were down to about 500 cubic feet a second. So things are good. Hopefully they'll stay that way. Tuesday, NIPSCO Communications Director Nick Meyer announced that a mechanical failure with a floodgate was to blame for the low levels. What we found was there was a mechanical failure on what's called the roller track. Uh, so kind of like your garage door, uh, you know, the, the ability for it to roll up and down along a track. Uh, there's a failure there. That means when crews went to close the gate, Meyer says it got stuck. He says it's a malfunction that doesn't happen very often. We really don't see this type of thing occur, especially given the amount of inspections uh, that we're required to do on a regular basis. So this is nothing that we uh, had anticipated or even seen uh, as an issue prior to this. Meyer says special equipment was brought in over the weekend to temporarily close the floodgate. He says permanent repairs to the gate began Tuesday. A scaffolding is being put in place uh, to, to do the repair work. Um, we'll continue uh, on with, with the replacement of certain parts of that to make sure that that's functioning properly. And really after that, um, uh, they'll, they'll be in a position to uh, be, be back up and running again. Meyer says the repairs should be complete by the end of the week. In White County, Elizabeth Rentschler, News 18.